Hello boys, good morning. This is a new day. And today we're gonna learn and we're gonna continue with comparisons. Okay, so stay focused, pay attention, and don't blink, okay? Grammar one, music in our world. Now, I want you to go to your student's book on page 45. In this part, we're gonna see uh, four different ways that we're gonna use in this lesson to compare. Okay, so pay attention. Now, pay attention to the next example. Ah, 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 I am not a good singer. But I tried to do my lesson, okay? So, well, in this part, we can see that the first example, the first one, the first guy who was singing, the guy with the funny hat, uh, he was singing louder. So, he sings more loudly than me. And now, we're gonna see the next example. Pay attention. I play the guitar as well as the guy with the fanny hat. Well, the next example is better than. I can say I play the bass guitar better than the guy with the fanny hat. Better than. Well, the next example is less often than. For example, I practice the piano more often than the guy with the fanny hat. You can say more or less often. For example, the guy with the fanny hat practices the piano less often than me. Because we can see that the, the, the guy with the fanny hat is not good at all playing the piano. And he's not good at all as playing the bass guitar as well. And he's not a good singer. But he plays very good electric guitar. So, I want you to continue practicing this way of comparisons. So that's why I want you to continue with the activity 11 on page 45. In this activity 11, you have five words from the list. You have beautifully, fast, hard, often, slow, 
well, and worth. The first example says he's good, he plays the guitar more often than he plays the drums. You have to complete activity 2, 3, 4, and 5. Number 2 says, That's not good. The orchestra sounds mmm. The band. 3. She practices mmm than he does. She plays at least twice a day. 4. I dance to hip hop. Mm, I dance to rock. And five. I play the piano. Mm, my older sister. Wow, this is not that simple. Okay. I'm gonna give you an extra help to complete these activities. Remember when we have short words like fast, slim, fat. Uh, we have to add an ER at the end of the word to make it like a comparison word. For example, fast, faster. And we have to say the word then after that. Faster than. For example, my car is faster than my friend's car. But when we have words with two or more syllables like famous, we have to put uh, the word more before the word famous. For example, more famous than. We cannot say famouser or famouser. No. We have to put more before the word. More famous than. For example, uh, I am more famous than my sister in the school. I know that you learned about this last year, maybe, or two years ago, how to make comparison sentences, right? Uh, but I want you to continue with your workbook. So on your, on your workbook, you're going to work on pages 32 and 33, okay? In the first part, it's going to give you a little explanation about how to use these four different ways of making comparison centers. Then, I want you to complete activity 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 in your workbook. This is all for this lesson, and remember that next Thursday, you're going to have an evaluated activity, okay? It's not going to be difficult, but I want you to be concentrated on this activity, okay? See you soon, see you on Thursday, and bye-bye. Take care and regards to all your family. Bye-bye.